Hey everyone, this is Sahel from Life of a Gamer. Today I'm doing an unboxing of Redmi 6 Pro, which I got on the first sale. It cost 999 RMB, near about $150. It's a busted phone. So let's open it. So the box is very similar with Redmi Note 5 Chinese variant. In India, it's Redmi Note 5 Pro. And this one cost me 999 RMB. This is 6. 3GB and 32GB variant. Throw, 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 throw it up. Start twerking like Miley. Oh, yeah. Twerking like Miley. So let's see the box. So Redmi 6 Pro, 5.84 inch and 19 by 9 full HD display, 4000 mAh battery, 12 megapixel and 5 megapixel camera. Redmi 6 Pro. So here 5.84 inch display, 19 by 9 full HD, camera is 12 megapixel, 5 megapixel with AI support and 4000 battery. So this is a busted phone, you can compare this with S2 or Redmi Note 5 Chinese variant. So let's open the box. This phone have a notch and this is the cheapest phone till now with a notch with this price. So we will see the phone later, it's near about 178 gram. So this time packing is a little different from other phones. There's a box and we have a silicon cover and some manuals, the warranty card. So here's a charger. So this phone doesn't support quick charge. And Xiaomi provide the 5 volt 2 ampere normal charger and the USB cable is type B so no type C and one SIM injector tool so let's talk about the phone so this phone is very similar with other Xiaomi's phone like S2, Y2, Redmi Note 5 Pro, Mi 6X you can see very similar just the size and something is different so my all phones are black so really confusing for me so 5.84 inch display on the top 3.5 mm headphone jack ir blaster one mic on the left side the same grid on the bottom one speaker mic and micro usb charging port power button and volume one and the back side the dual rail camera 12 megapixel and 5 megapixel front camera is 5 megapixel so this is a busted phone size is 149.33 mm long 71.68 wide thick is 8.75 and the weight is 178 grams so miui 9 so let's do the setup only five language two chinese one english and i don't know the rest one so the setup is complete so the phone look really good with the notch or with this price i really like it so let's see the features again cpu snapdragon 625 battery capacity 4000 Rear camera 1 megapixel, 5 megapixel, screen size 5.84 and resolution 2280 by 1080. MIUI 9.6, Android version 8.1, RAM 3GB, CPU octa core 2.0 gigahertz, and available storage 21.75 GB. So, this is the 32 GB variant. If you don't like notch uh, in the display, in the setting, you can hide notch. They have an option, hide screen notch, you can see. So like, but I like notch, so I don't want to hide this one. Now let's check the anti 2 benchmark scores. 
let's see the device setting here redmi 6 pro so ram is only 979 mb till the beginning is not so good so cortex a53 So let's do the test. So I skipped the test and the score is 78,348. So I think it's not so good. So the temperature of the phone is not so much, it's not heated up, only 34 degrees Celsius. But like I bought my Redmi Note 5 just for 1099, 100 RMB, more than this phone and the score is more than 100,000. So let's see the multi-touch feature of this phone. So only 9, not 10. Now let's check the video quality and uh, the sound quality of this phone. So the audio and video of this phone is really good. The colors are bright and variant. So now let's see the SIM tray. So this phone support two nano SIM and one micro SD card and we can expand till 256 GB storage with the memory card. So this is a nice feature for a budget phone. Now let's see the face unlock feature of this phone. So loading camera is taking long time. Yeah, it's done. So let's check it. Mm, not so quick. So now let's talk about the camera. This is dual real camera, 12 megapixel, 5 megapixel, HDR support. So in the setting, we can see the camera frame is for by 3, 16 by 9 and 18 by 9. But in the portrait mode, we don't have flashlight. And in the video, we have time lapse and slow motion. But this phone doesn't support 4K video, only full HD 1080p. So the primary one, primary camera is 12 megapixel with f2.2 aperture and 1.25 micron, and the secondary one is 5 megapixel, and the front camera is 5 megapixel with f2.0 aperture and 1.12. Micron and FPR support. So I collect few pictures so you can have a look. I will do the camera review later. So let's play a game, PUBG. So let's see the setting. So in the setting, we can't do high definition, only medium. No HDR, nothing else. So it's really bad. So I started a custom match for eight minutes. You just see, wow, it's lagging.
so I face a lag let's see further yeah it's lagging a lot of lag I'm facing in this phone so I think this phone can't bear heavy games so this is my first time in any Xiaomi phone I face lagging problem a lot of lag you can say and we are just playing on the medium setting not the high definition or the HDR mode so as the price maybe it can't you know support the high definition games so I will not recommend this phone to anyone if you want to spend near about $150 so it's better you can spend $20 more and buy Redmi Note 5 Chinese variant for 3GB and 32GB variant and I didn't face any lag in that phone in India it's called Redmi Note 5 Pro I will do a gaming review later but really disappointed with this phone just the look is beautiful the notch is beautiful but the features i really don't like So the gameplay is really terrible for me so quickly I die and I really don't like this phone <laughs> so my first impression is gaming is so bad I didn't like the camera so much but just I love the looks and display the phone is a little heavy also but it's a budgeted phone only $150 support 4G but not dual 4G, just the single one. So hope you like this video. Please give me your review. What do you think about this phone? And tomorrow me pad 4 is coming. I will buy that and give you a review and unboxing soon. And the camera review and gaming review and some comparison will also be coming soon. So stay tuned, like, share and subscribe.